how do you feel about this whole gender thing? Because again and again, I was raising with our last panel kind of something. It, it, men do react differently uh, than women and, and, and vice versa, particularly if there are attack lines back and forth. Right. Well, I, I'm a woman who's broken a number of glass ceilings uh, <laughs> over my career, and, and I understand firsthand, you know, what that means, but I'm voting for Donald Trump because I am a woman, and nothing says, you know, I'm a woman, hear me roar, like having your first national interview sit down with a man by your side. This is, this is an interview for the leader of the free world. And so, you know, as a woman, I want to vote for someone who's going to protect women like me who are survivors of rape. I want to vote for someone who's going to protect children who are victims of incest, like Donald Trump will. I want to make sure that single moms like I am can afford their groceries and their gas when they're trying to put food on the table for their kids. That, that person is Donald Trump because of his economic policies, like lowering taxes for the middle class, expanding the child care tax credit, those kinds of things, lowering, uh, you know, looking at the spending of the federal government, et cetera, and the the rise of inflation. I'm voting for Donald Trump because I want to be sure that biological men aren't in a locker room showering next to my underage daughter. I want to make sure men aren't stealing women's achievements in sports or academics or their scholarships. And that's why, as a woman, I support Donald Trump. And I want to see him come out strong for women's issues, as he, as he always has. We've had many conversations. He's one of the first Republicans to come out uh, very strong for IVF and supporting women and families. Um, he can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with her on women's issues. I feel very confident about that. His